Orlando has given us away oh, travel set. That's so cute. You can take that on the airplane. This is actually like three essentials for doing any holiday look. And then they sent us some anti-frizz hair sheets. I definitely need that. <laughs> this is something I've never seen before, so I'm really excited. So many products, it's amazing. I'm just excited to get stuck in. I'm gonna go through like your week in hairstyles and how we can transition one look to another. I'm going to section your hair and I'm gonna just use a light misting, thermal image. I used to have very straight hair when I was younger. When I hit puberty, my hair went curly. Well, that's why I used to straighten it, because I don't know how to deal with it. That's why I like using the Aveda V Curly Enhancer. It's such a natural product, it's lightweight, and it can adapt on anyone's hair. And what we're gonna do is just blow dry that in. And use a little bit of this rose oil on. Smooth through. So we like to keep a little bit of that natural movement in there. And then get yourself a hairband. Just get a nice high pony. I'm going to use the Christoph Robin lotion. That's going to give you your million dollar glow. Just give it a mist onto the hair. And that is Monday. I love that. I'm going to take you to a Tuesday look. That's going to be really super simple for you to do. Separate the hair and chain. And what I'm going to do is a messy bun. I'm using twists. So it just holds the curls a little bit closer together. Then I'm just going to pin this into place. The only times I do a bun is when I have straight hair. Oh, no. I really like it like this. And this is like a cool, cute way of you embracing your texture. There you go. I love that. It looks so like you just shoved it up, but it still looks In really a, good. In like, a yeah. more controlled way. Yeah. Yeah. Tuesday look to a Wednesday look. To let this all out, as you can see, your curls are still intact, so we yeah, haven't yeah. really like harassed your curls <laughs> in any way. For this, I'm gonna do a bohemian braid. A braid? Yeah. yeah. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna split into two sections, give a little twist, and I'm gonna cut that across just to your occipital bone, and then start feeding the hair through. Just going to do a nice undone braid. You can just pull some pieces out, Go in with the sea salt spray. A bit more like kind of effortless braid. I love it. Right, are you ready for Thursday? Yes, I am ready. I'm waiting for Friday. Ah, uh, don't wish the week away. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do for Thursday is I'm gonna blow out the curl. Yeah, I can't brush my hair when it's dry. If not, I just look like. I mean the thing is, it is quite cool. It gives it that kind of pre wrap like mm. feel to it, which is really airy. I went to Barcelona not long ago and blow dried my hair out. Yeah. The second I got outside, I went. <laughs> I was like, oh no. That's because you need something else yeah. a little bit heavier as your prep product. So I'm going to use the Bomb Bomb Bumble thickening spray now. And again, taking section by section. This is your like prep for Friday. The Just day so before you... the party. <laughs> exactly. So what I always like to do with curly hair or wavy hair, I like to start off by blow drying the hairline and smoothing the hairline first. It's always around here that you I can't get in. I always get that. And so, then I always burn myself. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to stop you from doing that. I'm going to go in with the thermal spray. I always like to use like a white tooth comb to comb back the hair. And then I just give it a slight nudge from the crown to see where the hair wants to normally separate. My brother once walked into my room and I had two things like this coming out of my head and half of it straightened. And he was like, what is going on? I was like, I know I'm just straightening my hair. He's like, wow, you look crazy. <laughs> but you know what? The results are worth it. <laughs> using this ball bristle brush because we want to keep it quite flat. It's quite a modern way of wearing straightened hair rather than using a round brush. Because what a round brush does gives you a little bit of unwanted volume in the hair. So I'm pulling my brush down to keep it nice and sleek and give it that really nice modern feel on straight hair. I actually really like seeing myself in straight hair. Yeah. I feel like sophisticated. She's a girl that means business. So I'm going to go back with my hair rose oil. I'm just going to focus on the mid-length nails. I'm going to a nice I love it. Look. And I'm just going to use one of the way anti-frizz hair sheets. So just for any flyaways. And this way I'm not putting any oil on your roots. I'm not making it greasy. I'm just making sure your hair feels and looks like silk. How's that feeling? Like <laughs> yeah. Perfect. 
So what I'm gonna do is change up your party. I'm gonna go for like old school Hollywood wave, but with like a modern edge to it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a side parting using the arch of your brow. I'm gonna move it over. It's a nice deep I parting. I like that. I never wear my hair in the side part. Do you know what? Always good to experiment. Yeah. So I'm gonna put my tongue just on your cheekbone. And I'm gonna start working back. Taking it quite tight around your face. And then from your side part, what I'm gonna do, start at cheekbone and then jawline. I'm gonna use some volumizing hairspray. Give that extra bit of hold. It smells amazing. Yeah, it does. I'm gonna go through with our Villa de Asia pure boar bristle brush and give that a nice soft. Oh, I love that. I'm using some of the hair and body mist to give some extra shine. Finishing with the oil. And last, but definitely not least, a bit of hairspray. And then flyaways and to hold. And that is Friday through to Saturday morning. Yeah, of course. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much. I'm going to wait this next Friday.